so we've got a new pretty little thing parcel because this is my possible work clothes for work obviously like for summer weather so basically our shop doesn't have aircon so i think i mentioned this last night anyway um or in the previous vlog so basically i'm going to show you what i've got um i'm not going to try them all on right now but i'm going to have a look and show them and see what i think because i got a lot of things which aren't my usual style i got a lot of floral things a lot of color so you know we're getting ourselves out there a little bit and then i'm going to plan to tidy my room this has gone down a lot this is my picture things i need to take pictures with and it's gone down so much there's not much left there um they're close to go away the cushions i'm debating whether to keep them whether to take them back to the range i'm so indecisive like they look nice there but i just i don't know if they go with my bed so i'm just gonna put the light on um this is everything i got split into colors <laughs> I got a few grey things. Um, I got a grey dress, um, a Chicago t-shirt dress, and a United States of America. I can't remember if this is a dress or a top. I don't know. Um, and then I got some pattern things. Like I don't know if anyone else is like this, but do you ever look at stuff and look at it straight away and be like, I hate that colour, so I'm not even going to bother trying it on because this colour is vile to me. No offence if you love this colour. I don't like coral. I never have, so that is a no straight away. Um, so I got this pattern dress, which I'm not sure of because I'm not really a red person. I thought this was pink, but we'll see. Um, this dress looked really nice on the model. It was very, very floral. And obviously it's got the corset, which I really liked. Um, so we'll see about that one. And then this is... Um, this one was really pretty on the model as well. This was like satin. It was pink. Um, and it had like a frill at the bottom, which was really pretty. Um, and then we've got this pink midi dress. Um... This one is like a white scuba frilly one. And then this is, I don't know how to say this. Brodery on, no, I'm going to bother. But yeah, it's like a lacy kind of white one. And then this is like, is this yellow? I'm so confused. It says cream, but I feel like Pretty Little Thing cream looks like yellow. So anyway, I'm going to try these on soon. Um, I'm going to get some of them out of the bag and look at them because I want to see them <laughs> more in detail. But that one is 100% no because... I don't like the colour. <laughs> so this is the first dress and I do like the pattern, but I feel like if it was cut, I would like it so much more. I'm just not sure. On the model, this looks so good. Like, I don't know if you've got to be a certain height. Like, I don't know if I'm too short for this. Um, but yeah, like, I like it to here. I'm just not sure about this. And I'm so restricted by this bit. Like, I, I can't walk. It's really, really tight here. Um, it's fine everywhere else, but it's just here. So, yeah, this is size 6 for reference, which I usually am, but maybe I'm not anymore. Um, but yeah, I do like it, but I'm not, I'm just not 100% on it. So yeah, this is the first dress. This is the next dress, and this is the one that I was most excited for. And this has literally grown on me so much, because I put it on, and I was like, I'm not sure. And then I really, I like, undid the corset and redid it and did it tight. Um, and now I like it. Like, it's a perfect length for me, because I'm short. It's a really good length. Um, I like how, like, it really pulls my waist in. By the way, this is a size 4, so yeah, my size is, like, all over the place. I love off the shoulder. Love that. Um, I love that it's, like, really accentuating, flattering, like... It is such a nice dress and I'm not usually one to wear stuff like this, like, I am girly but I'm not like vintage -y or like I'm not into flowers and plants and flowery patterns, <laughs> it's not me, um, but I really like this and I think this for summer is going to be so nice, um, so yeah, definitely for, for work for me this is going to be perfect for the shop um, and also like if I do do anything in summer that's, you know, a little bit more dressed up, then you could definitely dress this up with heels um, or dress it down with trainers so I'm not allowed either at work so I'll be wearing sandals or something like that um, but yeah I'm really happy with this I really love the sleeves like I'm just very very happy with this and it's not something I'd usually wear so I'm not a fan of this one because it, realistically I look like a box let's just be real I look like a box um, I think I've realized that this flare thing doesn't work for me um because you know we like things that show our figure and not you know if this was tight it won't be half as bad but yeah i look like a box and i understand like it's meant to be like this but it just doesn't work for me because i'm so short so yeah no to this one so i kind of knew as soon as i got this out of the package that this wouldn't be for me like i do like the square neck i think the square neck is flattering um and i like the length as well but i just something about this just does nothing for me like i feel like 
it's just, I don't know, a, bit, a little bit, I don't know, old. <laughs> Maybe it's the pattern. I'm not a fan of flowery patterns and I did like the other one because I think it was chunky flowers so I kind of liked it but yeah, this isn't really for me. Um, so I think we're saying no to this one. Next is this white off the shoulder one. So it's like all the way down. It is really pretty this one. This is definitely a work dress that I wouldn't probably wear it for anything else. Like I was going to say a wedding but you can't wear white at a wedding so. <laughs> so yeah. I'm going to have a think about this one. Not sure. So this is the next dress. We had to skip one dress because I actually got stuck in it and it was very traumatic. Um, but this is the next one. I do like this but I don't think for work. <laughs> It is nice, but I don't really need it. Anyway, this was the dress I got stuck in. I must have accidentally got a four, but some fours fit me and some fours are tiny. And it, that was a tiny one. Don't get it. So this is mommy. <laughs> Literally, me outside of work is now basically this. We like our baggies. We like our, you know, cool type clothes. <laughs> You know, this is what I'm like at the minute outside of work with my trainers, but we can't wear that inside work, so I'm a very different person inside work. <laughs> but yeah, this is where I'm up to at the minute. I've still got one more thing to try on. But yeah, at the minute, that is the main thing I'm keeping. So I only ended up keeping this Chicago dress because this is gonna be worn like forever. This will be worn even when it's cold. Um, and then I kept the green dress. Um, I say it's the green dress, but this one. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I've kept them too, and then I kept obviously this one that I wore yesterday. My wardrobe is looking full. We need some, probably another clear out in here soon, but I do like everything at the minute, so I'll give it a few months and I'll probably change my mind. Um, this is that Meshki dress again, that I've not tried on yet, <laughs> because I don't know when it, the competition is going to be. Um, but yeah, my room needs a little bit of a tidy, but it's looking better. I just made a cup of tea. Um, but yeah, it does need a little bit of a tidy because I've still got my old poly package to go through, so that's like the main thing. Um, but yeah, it's better than it looks normally. This one from the Home Cozy, which I've been waiting for for so long. Um, I'm gonna put this on my bed now. It's a super soft throw blanket. I got the big size. Um, it doesn't say which size it is on here, but I really hope it's big enough. I've been waiting, oh yeah, <laughs> 160 times 200 centimeters. I've been waiting a long time for this. So this is gonna go as the throw on my bed and bring a bit more white into my bedroom. I've just had like a little bit of a brainwave as well. And I don't know whether to put like flowers around my mirror, like, um, you know, like flower vines that I'm kind of tempted. Um, like the green and pink flower vines and then like maybe getting a small mirror from my wall and doing the same um, but yeah that's just kind of flew into my head and I could also put them up there but I'm just trying to think because I love the flowers in my bedroom and I don't know like we're almost there I just feel like something else needs to be done but I feel like I'm always going to feel like this um, but I can kind of imagine a small mirror going on the wall because that would be handy for like pictures and things and just maybe bringing a bit more light into my bedroom but the throw is on and how gorgeous is this it's so thick and soft like this is it in half um it's fleece on the inside and then like fluff on the outside it's so nice so this is it um with the throw on so it goes with my light a little bit more um i do really like that and it'll be so nice in winter i mean it's not the perfect time for it right now but it's so much better than the pink one i was just using at the minute um so yeah, I really like that. I'm going to put the white cushions back on now and see if it goes a bit more. So that's with the white cushions and the white throw. I've taken the grey ones off just for the minute. Um, so yeah, let me know what you think. Like, let me know if you prefer it like this or with the grey cushions on or, you know, whatever. I need some advice, so let me know. And also, should I do the flower thing? Should I do pink flowers or white flowers if I do as well? Because... I think white will bring a little bit more white but I do like the pink roses. Hey everyone, so literally all I've done today is go to the post office and sort my room out. Um, but I'm doing promo now, so I'm doing promo for these leather trousers which are really nice from Urban Bliss. I did promo for the leather jacket as well that I didn't film but it's like a pink leather jacket. Um, this is like one of my favourite work outfits so I'm taking pictures in this. I'm going to do like a full length one with some heels on in front of the kitchen I think. Um, so yeah, that's literally what I'm doing now. I don't know what I'm doing tonight yet but I've just curled my hair. Um, yeah, 
that's all my updates. <laughs> Literally so boring. So I've decided I'm going to do an Opoly haul and it is a big Opoly haul. So it might even just take over the whole video. But I'm doing it in vlog form because honestly I'm just over sit down videos. Like I don't like setting my camera up and hauls take so long to film. We've tried all the clothes on and stuff and moving the camera so obviously I am going to try this stuff on. Um, because I need to see if, it, if I like it. But I'm going to do it in vlog form so if this is annoying for you then sorry. But... I prefer it this way um so yeah i'm gonna get into everything and show you what i've got so i'm gonna flip you around um this is some stuff i've got more as well to come so this is the first bag so i'm gonna literally jump into it and show you what it looks like on so this is the first thing and this is the top it's like the satin top it's like um a peachy kind of color how pretty is this like this is stunning um so i'm gonna try this on in a minute i got a size um, six in this one, I'm usually six in top, so I hope it does fit me. It's got like the um, details going down the front and then just a zip at the back. So that is the first top. Um, and I'm going to open these ones now. Button tea crop top, which I saw this and I just fell in love with this. It's perfect for the gym or just chilling. Um, I got an extra swell. I've never bought from Bill and Tea before, so but I thought I'd try it. Um, so it's like this baby pink colour crop top with long sleeves. It's got cutouts for, the, for your thumbs. Um, and I also got the matching shorts in the next bag as well, so I'm going to show you them. Um, the next one that I got is this little two-piece. So this is like the fluffy two-piece, so it's so soft. So this is the top. I got like the v-neck one, extra small, um, and then the matching leggings. So yeah, I'm going to try all these ones on now and show you these ones. So this is the first set, and it is literally so cosy. Like this is the ultimate comfy set, but I'm just not sure if. I'm keen on the bottoms like they just don't fit me that well they're really really long and they're just not really something that I would wear on the bottom but I do like the top I think the top's really nice and I'd wear this with like jeans or joggers um and it is super comfy as well so I do like the top I'm not sure on the bottoms um, but this is an extra small for reference um so yeah this is the first set okay guys I messed this up completely basically um the shorts are in that bag it's other something else so yeah at the minute <laughs> i'll just show you these on so i'm going to try the gym top and the little corset top and see what they're like so how cute is this top it's just like a little so i love how it's square neck it was gonna look so cute in the gym or like on a run like i do any of those things or just chilling out you know going to the post office going for a food shop that type of stuff um but yeah i really like this the matching leggings are still sold out but hopefully the shorts match when they come um but yeah i really like this i really wanted like the little unitard as well but it was sold out um but hopefully it comes back in stock and i can grab that um but yeah i'm really happy with this little crop top so this little crop top is so cute it's like the little satin one i've got a very similar one already from up Poly, but i just love that the way that these are and i love the little corset details and how it's like comes over there um awful tan lines but yeah i really really like this i'm so happy with this i think when you know bars reopen i can wear this with a nice pair of jeans um so yeah i'm really happy with this so yeah i'm not 100 percent sure about the first outfit but i still really like i like really like this one and the last one so at least we got two out of three <laughs> I might as well just turn this into a collective haul and include them Sky dresses too. Um, but this is the white one. This is such a cute one. I wish I got petite because it is a little bit long. But this is a size 4 for reference and it does fit really nice. It doesn't feel tight. Um, I got a size 4 and a 6. This is a 4 and the black one is a 6. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd just show you it on. It's really pretty and it'll be perfect for just like throwing on um, when it's warm again. So yeah, I do like this one. I got this I, this dress from um, Madison Sarah's video. So yeah, shout out to her. Um, but I do really like this. I think with your hair in a bun or like in a ponytail, it'll look really nice. So yeah, I love this dress. Okay, so I am absolutely obsessed with this dress. I know I'm going to wear the hell out of it like I, this is a size six so it does have a little bit more room but it doesn't feel that much different like i'd say getting on this one was a little bit easier but it really there wasn't much difference i just wish again it was a little bit shorter but oh well um i just love the style of this like the milkmaid style um the off the shoulder i think it's so cute and i don't know if you can see but it's got like polka dots all over it i just think this is so cute it's gonna be perfect for the shop when it's warm um yeah, I just love this and I, I do love wearing black so 
yeah I'm really really happy with this so thanks Mads again um, for giving me the idea for this dress absolutely love it